What's going down, y'all? One half of the Wake Up Crew here to talk some WNBA prop bets over on Prize Picks for this June 1st WNBA slate. Got a couple of games on the night. Got some games about to pop off here in a couple of minutes, so we have no time to waste. Quick recap last night, Candace Parker absolutely destroyed a rebound prop. That was a hit. She hit that almost in the first quarter. Courtney Williams, under 12 and a half. She had 13. Bad beat there. And then Nalissa Smith over her rebound prop of five and a half. She finished the night with four rebounds, so one for three on the night. It's all right. Process over results, baby. The data was there. The plays were there. We found some more today. We've got two plays I want to talk about tonight. One under, one over. We'll get into it right now. All right, so let's pull up the board and get to it. And I want to talk about Stephanie Dolson, right? Her her, uh, her rebounds and points in the model spit out and under here. I'm looking at the rebound prop in particular. There's a little better edge on this going under four and a half boards. She's averaging uh, 4.2 over her last five. She's only averaging about 22 minutes a game. We've got her projected for right at four rebounds. So it's a close call, but you, you see here, Really, you know, the under, under. She hit over twice versus Minnesota and uh, the Connecticut Sun. But tonight versus Indiana, she's got to deal with Queen. Queen Egbo down low. She's got to deal with Melissa Smith down low. She's got she's to exert some energy with Kelsey Mitchell. I just don't think she's going to get this uh, going to get this rebound prop of four and a half. So I will be taking the under four and a half rebounds for Stephanie. And then I want to talk about an overplay, one that I like a ton a ton and overplay. Um, let's go to Emily Insler. So Emily, everything in the model looks good. Um, if you wanted to take her points over six and a half, I mean, the over for her just spit out a beautiful, beautiful green boy uh, for her to go over the points. It's actually the highest projection edge on the matchup tonight. 48.69%, the over the points total. I really like uh, this um, uh, fantasy score for her, for her because she does some things on the defensive side. And you look at over the last five. I mean, she's four, four for four in her last four. And then that fifth game right there versus Connecticut on May 20th, she went under with 17.7. Really loving her. The Liberty are one of the worst teams in the WNBA right now. So she should have her way with them. She's also averaging right around 30, uh, right around 26 minutes per game. Um, she's averaging 27 fantasy score over her last five, and we got a projected at 28.2. So Emily Ensler, I'm taking her over fantasy score, and probably going to dabble with her points in a couple of different uh, a couple of different matchups. A uh, few other plays I want to touch on real quick that I like. Uh, Ryan Howard is back in action. You can never go wrong uh, taking a bet on Ryan Howard. You just look at look at her points. She's had some back to back bad games. Uh, but her par and her fantasy score numbers definitely within within range for her. She's hit this points, rebounds, and assists number three of her last five. And versus Phoenix on the 29th a couple of days ago, she was right there at 20. Kelsey Mitchell over her point totals. I mean, that's that's just what she does, right? You go to Kelsey Mitchell. I know 18 and a half looks scary, but not for Kelsey Mitchell, who's one of the top scorers in the WNBA. She's hit this number in four of her last five, and it was just that anomaly game right here. I think we sh we took her the night she scored five damn points. But I like Kelsey Mitchell going over that point total, as well as Arielle Powers. She was 10.5 last game. They bumped her up to 12.5, but she's still well above her average over the last five. And this is a number I think she can definitely get to. But the two plays I feel real good about, Stephanie, Stephanie and Emily. Stephanie o under her point, uh, rebound total of 4.5, and, and Emily Ensler over 20 projected fantasy score. Those are two of the core plays that I'll be rolling with tonight. Prospects also has this thing out now for uh, WNBA points in the first uh, six minutes, two point attempts in the first six minutes. Let's just tap into that real quick. Uh, if I were going to take a couple in here and last night I, I dabbled in here and all four of the overs either hit or pushed Atlanta over two and a half field goals made in the first six minutes as well as Indiana over two and a half. I like both of those, and we'll be dabbling with that. If I was going to take an under here, it would be Minnesota starters under three two-point field goals in the first six minutes. So those are the plays I'm rolling with tonight. Stephanie, under. Emily, over. 
Let me know what you're playing in the comments below. I appreciate you tapping in the content. Comment below. Let me know what you're rocking with. All these picks are data-driven. And as always, you know the deal. And if you tell, give them hell. And if we fail, don't bail. We'll be back tomorrow with more picks. MLB, NBA, WNBA, we got you tapped in. Good luck tonight. We out. Peace.